Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Football Manager. We're taking on Manchester City at Stamford Bridge for this one. Um, as you can see from the previous encounters we've had against Man City, we've played them 12 times, we beat them 7 times, drawn once and lost 4 times. Um, the last result we had against them was a 2-0 win. So I'm hoping that we can recreate that uh, Man City's last game. They beat FC 20 in the Champions League group stage 8-0. So... Yeah, they're on a good run of form right now. But uh, the starting line for us today is to stay in goal. In defence, we've got Azbukwaita, Alderweireld, Azuma and Jokin Sayes. Centre of field with Hazard and Vidal. Mata and Oscar on the wings. Lukaku is uh, starting instead of Loriente for this one. Alongside Lewandowski. Uh, Man City filled in, as usual, a, a very strong team. Company in midfield, which... I didn't know that he could play in midfield, but hey-ho. Um... If we can if we can beat Man City, that would be awesome. Uh, a few of their players aren't on a, a great condition rating to begin this match, so I'm hoping that that will uh, play to our advantage. Only three players to respond from the team talk. De Stegen looks getting confidence. Mata looked delighted, and Lukaku looks happy. Hopefully, Lukaku can uh, can probably grab us a goal and show that it was the right decision to play him instead of uh, Loriente for this one. As for Quaita, start for us. Um, thought about keeping him on the bench, but to be honest, he is by far my best left back out of the whole squad. And ha has been my best left back for a number of seasons now. But as Alderweireld heads into the centre, Fellaini gets it. Tavares has an intercept, but Aguero's got it back to Fellaini. Tavares again, put that to Clichy. Man City passing really well. Aguero, good save. Good save from De Stegen. This is Cruz with the corner. And Zuma heads it out for another corner. Cruz again. Hazard headers it. Matt headers it away. Aguero gains it. Puts it back out to Cruz. And we've been given a free kick. Okie dokie. I'm hoping that we can try and... Uh, Get some action up their end of the goal because this is Matt with a free kick though. Lukaku, oh yes, we got a penalty. I think this will be Lukaku. Come on, Lukaku, please. Come on, take a one-nil lead going into half time. Lukaku with the penalty. Yes. Come on. Very, very important goal for us. Good finishing by Lukaku. I think he missed his last penalty that he took for us. Joe Hart gets the right way, but couldn't get there in time. One minute of injury time to be played for the first half. Right, okay. Now, surprisingly, we've had a lot more opportunities than Man City have, even though the majority of the highlights have been Manchester City. Uh, no one playing particularly bad for them. No one playing particularly bad for us. Um... We'll go passionate, try and, uh, yes, good response from the players there. Right, okay, we'll go into the second half. I've got a few ideas in terms of what substitutes I want to make in the second half, but depending on if we get any injuries or uh, hopefully, I, I don't want to jinx myself when I say this, but hopefully, um, you know, if we get any injuries or... Um, someone gets sent off. But uh, Alder Wilder and Zuma are having a real good game. As for quite, has been booked for persistent fouling. We're going to uh, get Lewandowski off. And get Unogalu on. And that's all we'll do, in fact. Come on, just over half an hour left of this match. If we can get a win against Man City, that'll be huge. We still got good options on the bench. Um, Loriente is on the bench. Should we need him? Ada World has been booked for persistent fouling. Come on, last few minutes of the game. We can do this. Three minutes of injury time. Zuma clears it. Aguero edge of the box. Shot deflected. Come on, let's get rid of this. Yes! Get him. We got the win. 
awesome. Absolute awesome. Some good performances. Um, you know, I'm happy with the 1-0 win against Manchester City. Uh, in terms of match stats, Man City had a lot more opportunities in the second half than they did the first. Um, our average rating was 7.47. Their average rating was 7.29. The best player on the pitch for them today was Fellaini at 9.0. He had a very good game for them. Um, Company had a very good game at 8.2. By the looks of it, Man City got quite a few players on real low condition rating. Um, maybe one or two injuries. But I'm very happy with that performance. Lewandowski was a little bit disappointing with the fact that um, you know, he didn't well, I, I didn't see him do anything of particular greatness, but a win's a win. Very happy with that result against Man City, and that's helped us even more in terms of uh, trying to win the Premiership this season. It's now 545 minutes since De Stegen last conceded. Whoa. I knew it was long, but I, I, I didn't know that he hadn't conceded a goal for that amount of time um, Man City are angry by the penalty shit happens is my response to that but our next match is against Wolves and it's the Capital One Cup quarter final this is the furthest that we have made it in the Capital One Cup competition in quite a while so um, yeah it's going to be an interesting episode Wolves I think we can definitely beat them we should definitely beat them but as you've seen with Football Manager literally anything can happen um, might have a few changes for that starting lineup, but a number of other results. Birmingham got a 3-2 win against Everton. Newcastle got a 2-1 win against Stoke. Norwich in continue to stay second in the league with a 3-0 win over Bristol City. Southampton got a 2-1 win against we over West Ham. Bolton and West Brom drew 0-0, and Man United got a 2-1 win against Fulham. Right, we'll have a look at the league table. With that win against Man City, uh, we're on 32 points. Norwich are in second with 27 points. Man City are in third with 23 points but have a game in hand. Tottenham, who are currently fourth with 23 points, have uh, three games in hand. So if they win them three games in hand, they'll be level on points with us. But um, yeah, very happy with that result, guys. Um, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Um, I'll have a few more double episodes coming out soon. Um, but yeah, I'll, I'll keep you guys up to date on that. But uh, yeah, thank you for watching, this guys, and I'll see you soon.